Uh, so the uh, the premiere the, the the first episode of Knight Rider is airing online. H how do you feel about sort of that idea of promoting? I think that's awesome. I think that it gives a chance for everyone who like uh, hangs out online and likes to talk about new shows and gives a chance for uh, for an audience to uh, get to know where we're going with the show. You know, I mean. Uh, they spend a lot of money on every episode to make it look like a movie for, for each episode. And so uh, I think it's important that they give a little taste test of what's to come. We're up to nine episodes right now. And uh, I tell you, every episode really feels like another action movie that, uh, that we really love, you know. And it has all those elements. And the creators are from some of the really cool shows like Born Identity and Mr. and Mrs. Smith and... Uh, uh, you know, Battlestar Galactica in Las Vegas who was on NBC last year for four or five years now. And uh, you put all those uh, ingredients together, you're going to have some badass episodes. So, you know, I'm, I'm very happy that they did it, and I don't feel like it's giving anything away in terms of, like, uh, 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 plots for the future, because each, each, each episode is pretty contained, and, uh, and you really get to have a nice, you know, bang-up time watching the show, and... Uh, 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 the first episode is a pretty good uh, precursor as to where we're going with it. So I'm, I'm excited for it, you know, and, and I'm glad they did it because uh, next Wednesday I, I feel like we're going to have a really nice turnout and uh, on the 24th at 8 p.m. And uh, 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 online, you know, you get to watch it. That's great. You get to see, you know, where we're going with it. But when you watch it at home on Channel 4 on high def, you're going to really get a good feel for the, the quality of the show. and. Uh, uh, every episode after that I think is going to be pretty exciting. I don't think they're going to put any more episodes until every episode airs after that, so, uh, so it'll be cool. And uh, so, so you filmed nine episodes. Is there one episode that you, is your favorite so far that you had a really good time doing? Wow. I, I want to say that almost every episode has a great thing in it, but uh, I, if, I can, if I can remember correctly, episode two is pretty awesome. Uh, it has a little flavor of Fast and the Furious. A lot of cool cars are involved in that, and uh, I want to say episode eight uh, uh, has has some really interesting things going down. Uh, but I, every every episode has has like a really cool element to it. And uh, uh, there's uh, episode six. There's a Halloween episode, which is kind of creepy, <laughs> and I remember having a good time on that one. Um, I mean, every every episode, like I said, has something really really cool, really interesting, and and Kit the car can do some fabulous stuff every episode I can't even keep up with the stuff that the kick of the car does and so uh, I'm always surprised every time a new script breaks and uh, always excited to join you know if, you know and, and put my uh, my input into into the show and what I bring to the table and uh, yeah I'm, I'm excited for it I think it's gonna be really cool and uh, we'll see what happens down the road and if you could guest star on one other show on NBC what would it be and who would you play I want to say it would be Heroes, and I'll play uh, another villain. <laughs> that seems to be the popular. Everyone wants to be a villain on Heroes. Yeah, why not? You know, it's a pretty cool show, and uh, my sister's a huge fan, and I'm sure she'd be really proud if I was on that show. <laughs>